you are Tim Wunsau from Chicago. I am uh, getting ready to go hit a um, chest and delt workout at Iron Fist. It is six o'clock in the morning. I'm gonna try to get in there early. Try to beat the crowd. But um, see, got me some flavor gains in there. If you if it don't look like this, then you f***ed up. <laughs> but um, yeah, man, we're gonna go hit a good chest and delt day. We're trying to use all these high carb days. Really try to keep all the weak points full. You already know how it is. We're trying to keep these these weak points full and um, to last us through this long, tedious sprint. But I'm gonna knock this, knock this cream of rice out, and then uh, I'm gonna holler at my child when I get in the car. Well, I just drove all the way to Mount Juliet thinking that the gym opened at seven and they don't open till eight. So I'm about to go back to uh, my home gym and get this workout in. Man. <laughs> what is up guys? So I'm gonna take you guys through this workout. This is quick clips. Um, there are like three or four exercises that were not um, recorded. So uh, first exercise is a superset. We're supersetting the um, leg raises, really trying to bring up those lower abs, doing it with the um, free weight pull-ups. I do pull-ups every back, every back day. I do pull-ups. It doesn't matter what's going on. I get at least four or five sets of pull-ups in because you gotta stay home with these basic exercises. Pull-ups, dips, stuff like that. That's that's gonna give you a different look, man. I promise you. Nobody's doing it anymore. Next exercise I went to, this was also a superset. This is the close grip seated row. Really driving those elbows back, pulling to the belly button trying to make sure I squeeze that lower back. Super set of that with the cable decline uh, chest press. This is to mimic the decline bench, dumbbell or barbell. Um, I actually like this a little bit better because you don't get as tired setting it up. And just to get a set in on the dumbbell decline, I mean, you guys know once the weight starts getting up there, man, it's an exercise just to get the weight set up. So this is a good alternative. Next exercise that I did was a straight bar. Uh, overhand pull uh, row. I mean, dude, I really love this exercise right here, man. It's really, it's gonna bring those de that detail out in the upper back, and you can feel every rep. So this right here was the seated chest uh, press. I'm using the uh, seated bench. I had to make a little setup because we don't have the actual machine, machine, but um, this works just as good, man. So the bench actually sits right up under my shoulder blade. So what I like to do is roll my my back, my upper back over the top of it and get that good stretch on every rep. Really letting those elbows drop back and then squeezing it at the top. Next exercise, we went and got to the incline dumbbell. And I mean, guys, I mean, you, you guys gotta, we gotta make sure we're really targeting the upper chest. They're, they're rewarding the upper chest in the bodybuilding community. Um, as far as judging goes, goes so uh, make sure you hit an upper chest, man. I did this for like four or five sets. And then the next exercise, I did the regular lat pull down machine. Pretty sure this is another four or five sets. Um, I mean, this is just a, I mean, if you're not doing lat pull down, bro, I mean, your back is probably narrow as your waist. But. Then the last exercise that I ended up doing was the overhand barbell roll. Really, really love this exercise also, guys. Um, if you do it at the end, the weight is not going to be as heavy, but hey, man, it is what it is. So I appreciate you guys coming through, checking out the videos, showing support. Um, 
please make sure to like share and subscribe really don't care about the sharing part just make sure you like it